the laurel.
silver movies ago. Remember sitting at an artist's display at QPAS 
one day, and him sitting down next to me in that beaming smile, <laughs> and telling me it was his first art to just play. And um, it just touched me deeply. And he won his prizes that day, and he was so excited and childlike. <laughs> We've spoken of stardust and magic. He walks on a cloud of stardust, and there are people who can bring stardust. stand before us, having been nominated and accepted by your peers. Therefore, as an outward and visible sign of this recognition, we accept the ancient and honorable order of the world at the end of this day. You will. <laughs> <laughs> Bring forth the sword of state. Those others in this pursuit, insofar 
as it may be in your power to do so. I do. This medallion symbolizes your rank and station. Wear it always with pride and with honor. Is there a mantle? The mantle of the Order of the Laurel. <laughs> that's great. That's awesome. I was doing something found it. I get it. If you have a chance to look at this mantle. It has his achievements. It has his deeds. It has his work. From many baronies and the kingdom as well. It just proves that Master Richard does help out regardless of his home barony or even kingdom itself. Okay. Is there a wreath of laurels? Therefore, we, Brian, by right of arms, King of Abel, proclaim you, Richard, a master of the world. Be the good Lord. He shall toast. In the light of beauty and art, there are those that not only work to further their own skill and knowledge, but share their passions with the populace around them. It is in honor of that commitment that we elevate Richard McCuth to the Order of the Laurel, done this day. Brian Rex, Leah, Regina. <laughs> Three more cheers.